Hello. Just want to show some tips on growing the cherry tree. And the key point you should know about. We live in the Midlands and it's mid March or early March now. And, uh, and this is about a three year old to four year old uh, cherry tree. It's about nine foot tall and it uh, should hopefully fruit this year. And uh, if you look closely, these are uh, leafing buds. Hopefully they should open into a leaf. And you can tell that by looking at their size. And they're, they're mostly single. But uh, if you look at a uh, fruiting bud, it's something similar to this. Yes, as you can clearly see, it's extended and it has a few more buds towards it. Let's just get that angle clear of the... And uh, you can see... Uh, one thing you shouldn't do is tie it too tight, like I've done so over here. Because then the cambium goes around it, grows around it leaving a bulge and that can uh, suffocate the tree at the bottom you can see the tree is slightly different in color and that's because uh, for the past few years there's been ant feeding uh, alphids and drinking the juice of the leaves of this tree so I've had to apply a uh, certain paste and glues to uh, defend this tree from the uh, ants but that's, that's had a negative effect on the bark and the box died off and it has because of its stickiness it hasn't fallen out so you can tell that from this so you can see that i've been uh, pruning this tree for the past three years and uh, been uh, cutting off because because we have these walls and the sunshine can't get to any anything below the wall so it's best to knock off all the buds and do not waste growth over here and let, let it grow from the top and open from the top that's it thanks for watching